It's always great when additional AutoCAD functionality makes its way into AutoCAD LT. You'll find that some big wishlist requests have been granted in AutoCAD LT 2009. First up are improvements to color. AutoCAD LT 2009 has expanded the color possibilities from the usual 256 colors with two new tabs in the Select Color dialog box for True Color and Color Books. The True Color tab enables you to select the Hue, Saturation, and Luminescence HSL, or red, green, and blue RGB levels. The Color Books tab displays a variety of Pantone and RAL color books, enabling you to select a specific color, making it easy to match up with real-world colors of actual materials. The External References palette now includes the ability to attach a raster image, like a JPEG or a TIFF, to a drawing. The process is the same as attaching another reference type, like a drawing or a DWF. You also now have the ability to detach an unwanted image. The third function to make its way into AutoCAD LT 2009 is the ability to create non-rectangular viewports. You can either define the viewport boundary by picking points, or select an existing object to turn it into a viewport. Last but definitely not least are fields. A field is updatable text that is set up to display data that may change during the life cycle of the drawing. When the data changes, the field display changes. For example, this rectangle has a field associated with its area. Stretching the rectangle and regenerating the drawing displays the new area. 